that the city of New York will divest from fossil fuel reserve owner companies. Today, the nation's biggest city says no more. We're asking the mayor and the governor to get on it now. Today, uh, created history. I've been watching the climate fight for the last 30 years. This is one of the handful of most important moments in that 30-year fight. Mayor Bill de Blasio has announced the details of divesting New York City pensions from fossil, the fossil fuel industry, along with beginning litigation against the top five companies in order to pay for damages caused by climate change in New York City. To be seeing a city like New York going up against one of the biggest corporation systems in the world, this is a huge signal that we're absolutely winning. It's time for big oil to take responsibility for the devastation they have wrought. This campaign was launched on actually the eve of Hurricane Sandy and was really started by local volunteers and organizers who saw what needed to be done and have been um, continuously fighting since then. Today's news means a lot to, to me as a Sandy survivor, um, resident of Coney Island, where the devastation really took place. So this is a great day to know that my pension money will, will no longer be invested in fossil fuel companies whose activities are destroying the planet and destroying the future for the students that I've spent so many years teaching. The campaign has done everything from gather petitions to direct actions to marches. We marched 5,000 people on the fifth anniversary of Hurricane Sandy over the Brooklyn Bridge. Really, we used every tool at our disposal to let our elected officials know. Thank you to the advocates and activists who called me a few times in the last couple of years. That's how this works. Pushing government makes us better. This is the beginning of massive action in all corners of our country. It is possible to have momentous wins in your, in your community. Start organizing everywhere, everyone, in every place. <laughs>